Hello you, welcome to Geekism and welcome to an update video of Planet Zoo. That's right, in the mists of the beta we do have some news to talk about. Uh, today was World Animal Day, uh, the hashtag was trending all day, and as part of it, uh, Planet Zoo uh, announced some new stuff. So they had a post up originally that said for every 200 retweets they'll do something cool. Uh, the post got uh, 1.2 thousand uh, retweets and we got uh, five things, so they owe us one. <laughs> uh, five things. Uh, three of them were giveaways. You could win some plushies and a lunchbox, that sort of thing. Uh, but we did get two new reveals coming with the full game in November. The first of all was a third transport ride. So we already have the safari truck and the train announced. Uh, this one is aquatic. It is a uh, boat ride. Uh, it looks really, really great. So uh, it's it's on a rail and there's no driver. I feel okay about that though. I feel more comfortable with this one being on a rail with no driver than I do about the safari ride being on a rail with no driver. So um, make of that what you will, I suppose. Uh, but yeah, it looks gorgeous. A really nice art style to it. The, um, the, the algae built up on the bottom of the wheels looks perfect. Um, and it looks to be a relatively decent scale for, for Planet, uh, which is pretty good. Uh, but overall, yeah, it looks great. So think of this like the Jungle Cruise, or um, I'm trying to think if I've ever been on one of these in an actual zoo. Oh yeah, Chester Zoo has one of these, a boat ride uh, that takes you around a few different exhibits. Really nice stuff. Uh, oh, and Longleat has a like a ferry ride that takes you into the lake where the hippos and the, uh, and the uh, sea lions are. Um, yeah, they're really good and, and nice just gives people a, a different sort of view of different areas and, and creates a bit of movement in the uh, in the zoos. Uh, happy to see this one coming to the game. Very similar to the Planet Coaster one that we got with uh, Adventure, I think it was. Adventure Pack in Planet Coaster gave us a boat ride. Um, but I do think the graphics are a little better here in Planet Zoo. Good uh, comparison of the two of them there, I imagine, uh, to see whether or not the graphics actually have improved. And I would say they probably have. Uh, the big one, though, is a new animal reveal, and it is the Okapi, um, which is a, a gorgeous, ungular, uh, very, very cute animal. Uh, it comes from the uh, the Congos found in Central Africa. Uh, it, it, like I say, it is an ungulus. It's, um, it has very similar sort of size and markings to a zebra but it's actually closely related to the giraffe it's uh, the other animal in the family of giraffidae so there's there's giraffes and and acarpies are both in the same um so, so the same family and uh, and yeah there's not much to say about them really they they stand at about a meter and a half tall um they're classed as endangered they're herbivores uh, interestingly though size wise compared to a lot of uh, similar sized un ungulates these ones actually um uh, hang around on their own they don't really uh, stay in groups. They only really come together to mate, uh, which is different to a lot of sort of ungulates of a similar sort of size and area. Um, but yeah, overall looks great. Nice reveal. I think we've known for a little while that Okapi is going to be in the game. I think that I think we might have somebody might have noticed the name in one of the uh, E3 built videos or, or something like that, uh, or maybe Gamescom was it? I forget now. But yeah, it's nice to have it sort of officially confirmed and our first look at it looking really good. Um, so yeah, that was it. That was their announcements for World Animal Day. I was maybe expecting a few more animals, to be honest, for World Animal Day, but there you go. Uh, still nice to see. Obviously, you know, we're still diving into the beta with loads of stuff, and we've got a month between the beta and the full release, so I'm sure they're going to fill that month with loads of uh, new reveals. And of course, we will keep them coming here on Geekism. Thank you so much for watching. Short video just to tell you about those two new things. I'll, uh, I'll see you next time. Be good.